<laughs> it's been a run on joke with my family. I'm a large man, 6'3", covered in tattoos, and here I am with this small little baby cat. Hey, baby boy. I love you. It is a contrast, the two of us, but once I got him, I fell in love. He loves it. First week, he would knee at me. It looked like he was asking to come into my shirt, so I'd let him in, and he'd just crawl in, poke his head out, and he would just hang out. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> Time for laundry. And Lucy's right there. Dolby, right on his shoulder. All the time. He doesn't like water. Oh, baby. Okay, maybe he doesn't need a bath. It's okay. Oh, he's He's <laughs> When I brought him in over the sink to bring him closer to me, he'd calm down. So I was like, okay, maybe if I get in the bathtub with him, I'm allowed to put him close to me and wash him. It's okay. I got you. Look at your nose. He's that calm. Just relaxed and hit the spots, Dad. Don't forget my ears. He's all about it. And ever since I figured that out, it's it's been a breeze. Over obsessive cat dad. Hey, Bubba. Dobby, come on. But when the game system cuts on, it makes a noise, and that's like a trigger in his ears. Like, oh, I just got a heating pad, and he'll run over to the PlayStation and sit on it. Nice little nap spot. But what he doesn't know is that his curiosity keeps unplugging the whole game system. <laughs> I'll be deep in a game and just cuts off. And I'm like, Dolly, <laughs> next. Stats are dropping daily. I never grew up as a cat person. I never saw myself winning a cat. Nobody. I was always used to big, giant, 100 pound plus dogs. It's my big boy, he likes the belly rub. In the beginning, I thought it was the honeymoon phase where I just wanted to be around him, I was obsessed with him, but weeks have passed, months have passed, and I still don't want to separate myself from this kid, ever. Dobby was the cat I didn't know I needed until I had him. 